Hello, today I am talking about how to set up Mithril with the NPM. Okay, so here we go. The first thing you do is uh, you need in, uh, to install Node on your system. So just go to the Node.js installation pages on the internet and download that. And um, with Node comes the npm, Node Package Manager. You need to be in the right directory. Now I'm in my example directory. And there you do npm init dash dash yes. This will create the package.json file. And um, the second thing to do is to install Mithril, npm install Mithril dot dot save. And I'm, I'm following the, the instructions on the um, Mithril installation pages. And this is really quick. You get a, a few uh, warnings, warning uh, messages, but uh, you don't have to worry about that. Um, and now you are ready to install Webpack. Webpack will um, take your Mithril project and pack it into a file called app.js. App this takes a little bit more time. So this is my file structure. I have an index.html file, so I just need to, to write uh, a template like this um, and add a script source and um, I can write bin slash app.js. That's where the package file will end up. In my index.js file, I will write a short script like this. Just uh, require, require Mithril and uh, type out with a render function uh, hello world in, uh, in document body or hello something. Back at the terminal, I will have to write npm start for webpack to package all the files to uh, the file app.js as you can see here. The extension watch means that Webpack, Webpack is watching the files for changes. So if I change anything, um, it will package the files again. And then just go back to the browser, open your index.html file, and it should show up like this.